Okay, Saturday it's raining. No, well, I don't know. That does that looks like weird garbage. Um, Saturday it's raining. They picked up our garbage. Maybe they just didn't get over there yet. Maybe. I mean, but that looks like heavy stuff. Garbage men don't work from like when I was a kid. You know, by eight o'clock you didn't see the garbage men. I think they were out like... at three in the morning. Well, I think up... people don't like it. Whoa, at three. dude. Yeah. Um, I, see, I see that. I don't think people like like at three in the morning. You know no, what I mean? No, but what happened is now uh, because the towns aren't doing it anymore. I think that private the towns did it. They take bids. No, when the towns did it, their guys had other things to do during the day. Yeah. You know, so they needed to go around and pick up the garbage early. Yeah. I mean, growing also, up in the it city, made sense because there was no traffic. There was a There's sanitation no department. Yeah, and they did it early in the morning before all the traffic right. began. Right. Right. Which but makes now, sense. But now I see these guys. When I'm at my three o'clock post yeah. in the afternoon, they're still out collecting garbage. Yeah, well, that, that's they they privatize it and it works differently, you know. It's like well, you I pay more for the same. Private companies that well here in Jersey, you pay more for the same basically. If the if the city took care of it, uh, they would have to abide more strictly to certain standards, and we went we would pay only uh, for the cost and not for someone to make a profit, you know. So, but whatever. Uh, yeah, I was gonna say like where we where we are, right? This is super. Oh Jesus, it's super densely populated, right? There's tons of places to be and whatever. I mean, it's raining. It's raining. But there's only three sales, but and that includes are, house and estate well, and everything. Indoor flea market, These are the two that we missed yesterday, right? And two are estate sales that we didn't go to yesterday. Yeah, because they were in another direction. And, and very high end. Long. Very high end. And I get it aggravated when I drive a four and I don't get anything. Yeah, like in this one, all they showed their was pricing is like crazy. They just showed Chanel jewelry. Yeah, they showed. I Chanel mean, I guess jewelry. you could have called and said it was like a lot of earrings, right? Well, there was earrings and scarves and. Yeah, so you Chanel. probably could have called and said, "Listen, what are you guys getting out of Chanel?" <laughs> and maybe they would tell you, but it's like. No, they probably wouldn't. It, probably uh, like you have to come to Chanel. It's like why? I don't want to come. You just think and stay. <laughs> you know, it's, if it's going to be expensive, you're far. You know, it's like I'll send somebody, or if I can't make it, but if it's like if it's going to be like a pair of Chanel earrings, three hundred dollars, it's like I don't want to go then. You know, but whatever. It's Saturday. It's it's the morning. We can go. You know? We're going to one flea market. AJ passed by the Focus one. They have that every once in a while. It used to be better. Now it kind of sucks. You know, because what happens is. Um, it's the same as everything else. People get on the inside. They say, I volunteer. And then what they do is they grab all the good stuff, you know? Yeah, we knew a lady that used to do that with the churches in the area. Just one. We oh, knew everybody. you guys don't know how to price it. Let me help yeah. you. And then she'd come out and brag. I'm yeah, we were in Union careful. City. Yeah, exactly. She goes, I'll just take this. Yeah, I'll, instead of you paying me for myself, I'll, I'll take these. Take this. Yeah. Right, and everybody's like, okay. And they, because they don't know, they're like, oh, that's a nice necklace. Yeah, you yeah. can have it. Yeah, uh, it's like people do that a lot of time, even with video games. She's like, they go like, oh, all right, um, so the games are five a piece. All right, you know what? I'm gonna take these games, but some of these games are worth more, right? And then uh, they're just the BS. You should ask this oh, much. Oh, really? Right? They tell people. That? Well, what they do is they drive up the price of the stuff that's left over, so they think the, the people are gonna make more money. They go, hey, give me these for this wow. much. But you can still make a lot on this stuff. I just don't need it for my why collection. You, if they're not giving you a hard time to take, just take the stuff and go. I take everything. Like, why do you have to? 90% like, of the time. No, no, but what I'm saying is that they, they're already selling you the ones that you want. Mm -hmm. So just go. Yeah, I know. You know, because we've seen that before, too, like. Uh, well, with, it's part like, of the a negotiating. Fur coat, a fur coat, right? So yeah. we're at a yard sale. And the lady's all excited. She just got rid of her fur coat for $25 or something. Mm. And this other buyer, who's a reseller, is yes. pissed that she missed out on a coat. Yeah. A fur coat for 20 So she goes over to the lady and tells her. You're stupid. Oh, you're. D well, no, that that was another friend that they yeah. called him stupid. which yeah. And he got really upset because they called him stupid. I know. But anyway, she tells the lady, oh, you sold that way too cheap. I would have given you more money. So now the lady's upset. I mean, she was just happy that she got rid of the coat. Yeah. Now she's upset because this lady's telling her she could have got more money. And I, what I told when the, and then the lady leaves and buys nothing. Right. So what I told the 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 homeowner is like, look, she's full she's of it. She's full of it. 
because if you if she had pet grabbed the coat first and asked you how much and you had told her 25 she would have snatched it up exactly she wouldn't have said to you oh honey this coat is worth more no nope. she wouldn't no which now you know, if so you had she's said just trying 50 to make... for the coat maybe she would have paid it but she wouldn't have paid you more yeah she wouldn't have would offered guess, more but you wouldn't have known to offer more because nobody exactly. told you it was worth so you got more. exactly what you were going to get so you you would have gotten exactly what you just got now from her from her because she's or not going to offer you money on it. That's too cheap. You know, so... How can he give I you said, more don't, money? Don't let people make you feel bad. I do bad. that with friends sometimes. No, I the like stupid a, thing was it was a German coffee scent. This was yes. back in the day. Long time. 15, and 20 years. a friend years. of ours had sold the coffee set for like I, I don't know. Probably 20, 20 30 bucks. bucks. He used yeah. to sell stuff cheap. Yeah. He used to get he it cheap. he would get it for free. Yeah. He would plumber. He would go into people's basements and they'd say, you want this stuff? Here, yeah. take it. Or he'd no? say, I give you 20 bucks for everything. He'd go, wow, 20 bucks. I'll take it. No, he was always telling me that women were giving him stuff when he went, when he was, yeah. Okay. Whatever. So he sold it for like 20 bucks. So then some lady comes up behind and actually called him stupid. Yep. For selling it so cheap. Yeah. So what happened was we used to buy a lot of stuff from him. You're not going anywhere. It's one stupid lane, dude. Get back yeah. in it. I'm not going fast enough for the dude behind no, me. No, I, 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 I don't get it. I'm you not going to be on top of this guy in front nope. of me in the rain. Nope. Let him get. Okay. Let him rerun so, us. Nobody's going to rerun whatever. anybody. I got a new car. My neck hurts. Anyway. Yeah. So they called him stupid. So they called him stupid, and at first he thought he had sold it to us because we used yeah. to buy a lot of stuff from him. Yeah, so I was he found us at the flea market, and he said. Did I sell you that pot with all the cups and saucers? And I we said didn't no. Usually like that stuff. No, I said no. Too nope. much pieces. Too easy for things to get broke. I was like, yeah, no. and then he told us a story, and, and then I he told us the story. And I said no, Matt. Like if you had sold it to us, I would have just given it back. Yeah, if you, you. said, like, can I have this back? Yeah, because, I would. Or can I have more money? Either I would give you more money, or I'd give it back. But, but I said I didn't buy he it. He was so upset that she called him stupid for yeah. selling. I said again, Matt. If you had told her $20, she would have snatched it up. Yeah. She would not have said, sir, you're selling that too cheap. No. Nope. Here, let me give you 50 You got she's exactly not what you're going to get. do that. From her. If you give her a price, anybody. she's going to take it. Or she's going to ask for it cheaper, because I've seen dealers yep. do that, too. Yeah. Or like, it, with the gold that time. Yeah. The lady is selling a gold bracelet for eight bu uh, for 15 bucks. Yeah. It's and like, the buy it and it run. Eight. Buy and it like, and dude, run. what are you doing? Yeah. And he's bothering her for like 15. I'll give it to me for eight. And it was a thick bracelet. It was the most ridiculous so thing I, I saw in my life. I finally had it. And I said to him, I was like, look, either give her her $15 or put it down. Because I will give her the $15. Yeah, just, I'm, I want to buy everything. You know, it's like, what are you, why, why are you doing that? You yeah. know that's worth much more than 15. You could have had everything. She's only asking for 15. Dumb, dumb. When I first got to her table, it was full of gold. <laughs> and I said to her, you know what you're selling, right? Yeah. You're selling gold. And she said, oh no, I know what it is. I don't care. I just want to get rid of it. Yeah. So we I'm just. like, okay. I think she got it from a ex-husband ex or something. Or she just husband. went out of the house. I don't know. Yeah. Women do that sometimes. But, yeah, they, <laughs> They sell off their husband's they, collection. They cut off their nose to spite their face. Maybe. Or whatever. I don't know. You no, know, it's out of anger. Yeah. I've done stupid things out of anger. Yeah, everybody true. has. We all have. But anyway. Nobody's, you know, when you're angry, you're. Yeah. Um, oh, well, anyway, the first sale we're going to is that we actually have the greatest potential of getting something. Oh, that reminds me. I have to get over it later. Because it's a regular sale. Where it is. It's like a, uh, it's not exactly, it's like a charity thing. It's a charity for animal rescue. Yeah. And they have it's, flea markets once a month. Yeah. Uh, but that's why I say they're picked for now. In the summer. But like you said before, they get people who volunteer to help them. Qu air and quotes they volunteer. Snagger, you know, yeah. stuff beforehand. Especially the jewelry. You know? Yeah, because there was a guy down in Florida that would help the local thrift store to price their stuff. Yeah, or the estate guys, and they overpriced. He would price it high, and yeah. then people walk in the thrift store saying, "Why is this thing fifty dollars?" Yeah, and they would because people at the thrift store think thrift should be thrift, you yeah. know. So in the end, when it didn't sell, he'd come back and he'd be like, "Oh, I'll buy it from from you. I'll, I, you know, I'll give yeah. you half." You know. Yeah. So like, what the hell? Yeah, you charge it retail, and you say, "Well, you know, I usually pay this much, and you know, you're not going to be able to sell it, so I'll just take it." You know. Here, I'll give you this much for everything. And at that point, they probably made a lot of money on other stuff that no, he didn't they want. Didn't sell the other stuff. No, no, on stuff. He, you know, people always overprice the stuff that they want to get in the end. Mm. You know? Um, I don't know. I just think that's bad. 
juju like that's I don't know. Maybe you're not looking out for your client, but whatever. But you also have to be realistic. You know, so that they're just basically, they're probably in the end, unless they take it for free, uh, in the end, they're getting the client well, the same thing, but they're getting the item. That actually ended up going out of business. Yeah. Probably because nobody was buying anything there because it was way too expensive. Probably. You know, you get, if you're a thrift shop, you want to sell stuff, you know, and it, if, and if you're stuff thrift, that you're they thrift. thought was like, it was like, oh my God, there's, there's like, I know, like collector's plates. We find, just had a relative call us yesterday. Oh, and don't said, you want those? I'm like, no. Yeah, they're like, well, I forget who makes all those stupid plates. but uh, Somebody passed away, and yeah. the family's throwing things out. So yeah. my relatives rescued Focus. records and collector plates. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> like Elvis plates. <laughs> like, you know, what people think to rescue, unless yeah. it's rock or punk I was like, jazz, thrown in the lake. If it's, if it's like <laughs> an opera <laughs> and Broadway. I said, I said listen, have a yard sale and and sell them at your yard sale and whatever they offer just take you know and the, oh, don't you want their collector plate no. like oh my god you can't I don't even know he, what, he, the what, what he told me they what they were I was well, like well in this area the northeast but what I don't is, know about what, what did he say what kind of plates were they I don't remember yeah I know right like, we were so like not interested I don't care about collector <laughs> that's what I'm saying it's like they don't even remember he says yeah Franklin Mint Bamboo yeah that's it Franklin Mint They've got uh, Buy their silver, though. <laughs> if you see stuff and stuff. Yeah, here it is. Yeah, they did put some stuff under there. That is like the worst. Well, everything under there is going to get all wet. So. All right. But yeah, I'll just shoot one side. Comes. Okay, well, there's one parking spot left. Sweet. It's all ours. All right, we're going to go inside and I don't know if we're going to get anything, but whatever. We'll try. It's raining and annoying. Uh, I don't know. I'm going to have to, I'm going to wind up at the store. So I'm just got to do um, my pickups. Uh, from the car again. I'm at uh, Focus Flea Market. I got a Pokemon skateboard. It's beat up. Uh, it was five bucks. I'm going to put it in the store window for display. You know, I don't think I can sell it. I, I'll have to check, you know, depending on the date, but it's beat up. So, and here's just, it's just some random Lego stuff in a Lego box. It was so cheap, two bucks. I just bought it. There's something G.I. Joe and I saw something Tonka. But it's just parts. If I can't get more than two bucks for it, though, I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, uh, I got a bunch of junk in the car that I just got to get out of here. Maybe I'll put this stuff in the back, in the trunk, just so I have room. Oh, all right, that's going to fall. Let me see if there's a date on this. 1995, 96, 98. Maybe it's old. Don't know. If, it old, if it's old, it might have some value. Condition, condition, condition. Anyway, I, I got more stuff to get. Bye. I probably did it when I, well, whatever. Hopefully I didn't see it. I, so far I got this, that pan, and I got this. That's a Wagner pan. Uh, Pro Tumbler. I'm hoping this is worth at least 50. Uh, if not, I'll sell it at a flea market. Okay. Rock Tumbler. Um, this is, this is a back massager, or a, a, an in general massager. Uh, to be honest, I'm probably going to keep this because my back hurts. That's why I said it's a back massager because my back hurts. Um, we like this plate. This is oh, it's Danks. Okay, all right, that's cool. Um, I think she paid not a lot for it. This is very interesting. I'm assuming it's Chinese. Oh wait, Excello. These have age. They're a food warmer. You put the food here, hot water in the bottom, it keeps your food warm until you're ready to eat it. They did that before they had microwaves, I guess. Um, this is a really pretty Murano bowl. Unfortunately, it's it's not, There's it's an imperfection right here. That something snapped off of it or an extra piece of glass. Beautiful bowl, we'll probably just, we might use it as a candy dish at the office. This is either going to be a Waterford Christmas ornament. Yeah, this is a Waterford Christmas or ornament. I was probably a dollar, 2008. As long as it's worth, say, more than like 12, I'll just put it on eBay. Otherwise, nobody will buy it. Um, this is a. Uh, I, I've had these before. This, I'm hoping, is worth at least 25. It's a Nibro. Um, Viking, I think it was a dollar, so who cares? I can sell it at a flea market or pretty much anywhere. 
And then, oh, we got a C2 lifetime guaranteed bird feeder for the birds. And then we have some of these listed on eBay. We haven't sold a single one yet, um, but they're John Lennon cups. So I bought them anyway because we're just adding on to multiple listings. Uh, these are all the same. They have more. Uh, they're all the same. They have more. So I'll just put, add them onto my multiple listing and I'll just, whatever, let, let them sit until I sell them. Okay, um, Marie bought a, a silver bracelet, and it has hearts in it. It's actually, it's kind of pretty. And besides that, she bought this, which is a heron cat box. Um, she's checking prices on it now. I think you think it's what, at least like 50 bucks, something like that. 40 or 50. 40 or 50. They seem to sell for like... 40 or 50. Yeah. Okay, not bad though, because she only paid... Red means five? Yeah, I paid five bucks. Okay. Alright. Alright. Okay. Everything we got just now we spent one twenty five. This is really nice. I think it's worth at least a hundred. The little fish. There's wax in there. This is Venetian glass. It's very delicate. Dolphin. It's dolphin. It's a dolphin. It's it's much you can see the eyes. Are applied it's much lighter than it looks it's got uh, mica or gold fleck I don't know some people say mica some people say gold fleck um, they had a price of 75 on it which was you know okay but fortunately for us today was the last day of the sale so everything was half price I don't know if she gave me any discount I didn't want to pay 60 for those uh, those two things I mean maybe even 50 would have been okay so that's why if you say yeah, okay, she discounted more because if this was 35 and these were 60, that's 95 right there. Plus, she got the jewelry, so. This is an enamel um, painting. I like this one better than the other one. I would have bought this one and not the other one if she had been uh, super firm on prices. Um, Artist Fleming, I forget his, uh, his first name. It's not Ian Fleming, Fleming the guy that uh, did James Bond, some other Fleming. Uh, and this is also the same artist. I have stuff by this guy that looks like this. I don't have sailboats before. This is stuff that I buy for now. Um, we should start listing some of this stuff, though. Yeah, I might keep some of it, but I like better. Um, I like enamel painting, so I probably I have a whole bunch of them. These are beautiful. This is uh, this is like a French, probably what do they call it? Plique jour. Is that what it is? It's just enamel. So, it, but it's probably French, right? It's not Chinese. No, it's G. It's probably Chinese. It's G. Oh, I see. Okay, yeah, all right. The work looks really nice. Um, they had 50 on these, um, but you like them enough. Are they silver? Or They're not gold. Do you think they're gold? They're not gold. Okay. This is pretty cool. This is... Uh... Oh, this is from Holland. No. It says Holland on the back. Yes. I'm oh, trying he's... to do something. Well, then why are you going nope when I say this from Holland? Because nope. I'm talking to my phone. Oh, oh. Phone nope. Phone nope. Okay, so this is jewelry. You have a little bit of jewelry here. Can I have it? Don't... Yeah, go take it. I was going to put it with your other stuff, but that's fine. This is one. This is a... I already showed this. And then the last thing is this. This is some kind of... It's contemporary sign. I think Steuben makes glass that looks like this. You know? I didn't want to say Steuben. Like older Steuben. But it's not Steuben. It's somebody else. It's got a beautiful luster. Um, it looks like G. Tama, Thomason or Thomason or something. I don't know. Maybe you guys will recognize it. G. And I, that looks like a T. Phone is telling me to move objects away if I want to be more in focus. All right, all right, but there you go. That's definitely like a Steuben S type luster. She said she had it in the case. Nobody looked at it. Uh, it was the end of the day. She was like 15. I said, "Would you take 10? Because it's it's not old. I mean, but I I like this. I'll I'll keep this. But um, that's it, right? Oh wait, uh, can I see that thing? This is the first thing Marie bought. Uh, it had 95 on it, and she got it for like 45. 
I don't know. I gotta figure out how she figured out the pricing because she took money off. Yeah. Well, okay. Everything. If she went half on everything, it would have been sixty for my frames. It would have been thirty-five. Um, that's a hundred, right? Right there. It would have been. This was what forty. She told you forty on this, right? No, at first she told me 15. And I'm like, are you sure? No, no, I what, what did she say finally? She didn't say anything. She, she just put down all the um, full prices and then cut everything Well, in then half. it would have been 40, right? No, because it was 95, so it would be 47.50. I'll just say 45, just for simple math. 95 plus 10 is 140, right? And then this, this she had 50. That's 190 for these two earrings. One of them you're looking up now. Yeah. 190. Oh, oh, but oh, it's wow. got a different. But this is Etsy. Yeah, I know. But but at least, you know, at least there's money there. It's not like, and you found what it is right away. It says 1950s. Um, the thing that she showed is, is 200. Obviously, it's not 200. Then this would have been another 10. So that's like 200, right? And I don't know how much that other thing was. And I don't know. Is that it? So she, I don't think she really went half, did she? I said I had to figure it out. Well, actually, no. This would have been ninety-five. So yeah, she went less than half. So yeah, but, okay, that's everything. This is really cool. Uh, I don't know if I talked enough about this, but this is kind of a repose, um, sterling enamel, and it's like it's a it's kind of a fire starter or a candelabra lighter. Here, you push you push this lever, and this comes out. And you light candles with it, so I think that's everything. Oops. Okay, let me get back in there. All right. So we're waiting at a long ass train. So uh, Marie and I are just going to talk about the last estate sale that we went to. Okay. So one of the things you bought was a, a fire uh, fire starter. It's and you fi just figured it out it's uh, for Shabbat. Yeah, right. It's for Shabbat. Shabbat. To light the candles. To light the candles, right? Now, um, originally. Well, it had a price on it. The lady $95. said, $95. Right. But the lady, you so pick it up. I said to her, I said, uh uh, this is because she's like, at first she told me she's not sure if it's sterling. Right. So, but I found the 925 mark on it. It was really small and yeah. on a corner. But and, what did she uh, tell you at first? She said, I said, well, because today they were doing everything was like half price. Right. So I said, well, how much would this be? And she said, you know, I'll give it to you for 15 And I, it was marked 95 Right. So I was like, are you sure? You see what it's marked? Yeah. And she said, oh, yeah, you're right, you're right, you're right. She said, you know what? I'll do 30 because it's it's light. It's not a lot of weight. Right. But when I came back to pay for it, it now bad. she's lining everything up. She's writing down the full prices. Yeah. And then she's cutting everything in half. Well, less and than I half. And I said, but you told me I could have that one for 30 she said, no, but remember I made a mistake and blah, blah. And I'm like, yeah, you made a mistake because you said 15. Yeah. So I ended up probably paying like 45 I don't think something. so because we paid 125 for everything. And uh, my the pictures I took were 120 oh. by themselves. So, so yours were 60. Yeah, probably less. My earrings were 25 because they were marked 50. 50, yeah. That's 85. So, and then you say if yours was 40... That would have been 120, uh, five, right there, right. So she went less. Plus, I don't know. You got something else? No, she went half, and then she knocked a little more. Yeah. But it just—I mean, I, I get it because so that anyway. other lady and her husband that were there were really annoying. Yeah. And they kept wanting them, whatever she gave them. They still wanted it cheaper. But see, the and they were doing that thing where she, they were giving it. They had a pile. Yeah. So she's going through the pile. Yeah. She, and she's marking it all half price, uh, like she told me. them. And then the lady's like, okay, what deal do you do for me? She already marked it all half price. All right, I got to continue this because I had a point to make, but AJ's calling me, so. All right. So anyway, the point that I was getting to uh, with where we were is, once again, it's a state sale. And pretty much everything was, like, near or full retail. So prices were fair if you want to keep it, but not fair if you want to make money. So that's why, like, even the Russian lady, it's like... I know they're annoying when they negotiate like that and stuff like that, but the way I look at it is everybody can either say yes or no. So it's it's a it's the well, her it's job. Well, just that the lady was telling her no. 
and yes. she just kept going on. But it's like, her like, job. She's like blowing her kisses and yeah, stuff. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. But it, it's her job to get it as low as possible, and the uh, it's the other person's job to say no. But look, it's like late in the day, it's raining. They're not going to do it again tomorrow, right? So what's the difference? At, like a little bit here or there. Take the money. Get the people the money. She's going to sell that statue? She want to deal with that statue? Somebody offers it. They have it for two. Somebody says, one fifty. One fifty. I'll buy it no, right I now. I think they had it for three. Whatever. You know maybe what I mean? Maybe they had it for four if she's telling her two. Yeah, maybe four. Maybe four. Because everything was half Or maybe price. she wasn't going down that because everything was half price except for certain things. Remember? Like, uh, I know the gold shouldn't be half price. Well, right? no. Yeah, because the gold, uh, I guess she priced it for weight. Maybe. I mean, I would have, so if I had a scale, like, I would have looked it out. Just, half on the gold. I'll say, here, let me throw it on a scale. Let's just see what happens. Yeah, because she could scrap it. But the thing is, like, even, okay, if she scraps the gold, even if she gets 50% of it, <coughs> you know, that's, and the, and, the, and the, the owner gets 50%, it's like she doesn't have to go that low. She's going to, you know, she can always sell for scrap. But, like, the enamel paintings, they had them at 60 apiece. Online, they're like 60, 70 bucks. Right? No, they had them for 120, didn't they? My enamel paintings? No. Oh, they were 60 each. She had them for 60 was... each, yeah. Um, your um, candle. You paint. know what? She wrote down 120, so that's why that's stuck in my head. Yeah, yeah, 120. Because she, what she did, let me just she write it down this together, way and write yeah. it down. And I'm like, yeah, I don't want to do that. I want to pay this much for that and this much for that. But when she, when it came to whatever, and you're like, okay, I was like going to go, like, hey, can we do 100? You know, that kind of thing. Oh, well, then open your mouth. I couldn't. You're faster than me. You're no. like, okay. I was about to go, like, can we do the about... I, I literally said, I went like this. I don't think I My lips started first, moving. I was upset because. Nope. My she lips started to move. I think you were frustrated. All I the just, times like, you talk over me, and this one time you because don't. you jumped in from it. Oh, I, I, I started so to open my, my lips. Oh, I was like, okay. I, I'll, I'll, I'm doing so this thing where I'm opening my lips now, right? Forget you. It's not we're your gonna, fault. We're gonna buy shit you just jumped on now. it. You jumped no, on it. No, 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 no. Don't yeah, I brought the me. price of your stuff down. Yeah. So anyway, oh, okay. anyway. But the whole thing is what I'm saying is everything they had there. Okay, even the fish thing, right? I found one online which is an auction out. It's like a hundred bucks. You passed all the restaurants because you're blabbering. Well, we're going to one more sale, right? No. We're I thought done. we were going to three. We went to three. We did? Are you sure? I feel like three. Yeah, I'm sure. You're dumb. We went to no, we went to the, the town. We went one. to focus and then we went to the two estate sales. That's three. Yeah, you're right, we did. Um, okay, so anyway, uh, just pick something good to eat. So anyway, part I was making two points, right? One was the lady had everything priced right, even uh, even the fish, right? Even the fish. So she put it seventy five. Maybe it's worth a hundred, right? That's what we kind of figure now after we looked no, at I it. I saw people listening for more than that. I know that, but I mean, what do you think you're gonna get? I don't know. I couldn't do. I couldn't do extensive. Okay. Wee water. Uh, um. So, but but. I should have made one. See, you gotta here. be talking and doing this. You turn. Thing. We're not in a rush. Wherever you want to eat. So, um. Okay, so. Yeah, okay, and the other stuff you got the jewelry, right? 50. What do you think that's worth? The earrings. I know you saw it for crazy price, but you didn't finish doing research, right? You saw one for like crazy price, right? You showed it to me. But, alright, so anyway, that was my point. We go to an estate sale, and it's on the last day. And it's raining. There's not a lot of people there. You got some people willing to, to buy and and just move it along. And don't try and get full retail. Because at that point, nobody wants nobody's gonna buy it for full retail. So just take what if even if you go, I can go half, but and they're not gonna buy it because honestly, I wouldn't have bought the, the two of the things for sixty. You know what I mean? I would have bought one for thirty. And left then the other you need one. to talk to me before we go up and price things. Well, the lady took the stuff and brought it up, but I was going to talk at the thing, you know. But you should have said to me, "These are marked sixty, but I don't want to pay." 30. I was, you were there when I said it. You, you were there when what? I said. No, now you're saying best? things. What was your absolute best? I'm like, what's your absolute best? And she goes, "Well, I have sixty pieces." I said, "Yeah, yeah I know." <laughs> I said, "Yeah, your absolute best." She goes, "Well, listen, I, I, you're." Uh, you said, he's with me, and I have a pile. So, okay, we'll make a pile. Um, it doesn't matter. I'm okay with what I paid um, for them. But I wasn't going to pay 60 And I know I didn't pay 60 really. Because we got stuff for left. I, and I like the vase that I got. Um, I'm cool with the 10 on that, for sure. And I, I'm debating, if I can figure out who the guy is, I might sell it. Because it's not that nice. 
If I can't figure out who the guy is, I'll keep it. But all right. Anyway, that was the add-on to uh, to uh, uh, I don't even know what the point of this. All right. Maybe we will get something at the store today. <laughs> Bye. I heard we had a real crapo trade in already. Yeah, because he was playing it. Okay, so a um, couple of trade-ins at the store. Nothing to write home about. What's that? Well, you could decide what to do with it. You know? Uh, you too, right on home. Chris Rock. Well, this is unusual PSP stuff. Sahara, Coach Carter, Bobbit, Basics to Boogie. What the hell is that? I never even heard of this. Okay. I played Mech Assault. I liked it. Uh, it was a good game. Uh, sports. Sports! If anybody ever heard of the Viagra boys. Sports! Battlefield. CSI. Did the CSI game used to be worth something? Yeah. Is it? Oh. That Tiger Woods guy never came back, but he wanted whatever. His car, he has the stuff from Sam's Club. Sam's Club. Okay, sounds good. He, he bought himself Slim Jims, and he said that he, he said that he wants to return it. We're not paying for it. I said, I guess we're paying for it now. Why? I mean, like, why did he buy Slim Jims? I mean, I know you like them. They were for the store. Oh, uh, AJ will eat it. I don't like I said, it. I said I don't eat that, but whatever. What about Dave? They're not even regular Slim Jims, AJ. Start. How much were they? $18. I don't care. It's fine. We're treating you. Because what? we're we're so good to you. That's some sorry card. Ugh, fine. fine. Take fine. you can only take one home every night. <laughs> I'm in here in a package. Fine. It's also mild. mild. They're mild they're beef. mild for like babies. <laughs> okay, bye. All right, more pops. Well, actually, no. These are the only pops that came in today. Uh, we had a. Well, you know it's raining out today, so we get a lot of excitement going on. Go ahead. Uh, I'll just show you everything that we got pop wise. If anybody wants anything, just let us know. Message through either the Facebook page or Instagram. If you see anything you like, uh, most of these will probably wind up at the flea market. They're not very valuable. Probably the most valuable one here is um, the Emperor Callus from Destiny. Uh, but we do have a set. So there you go.